you can't start your path unless you've presented yourself in a positive way. You're gonna need help along the way. And not many people will help you if you're not good, right? You have to prove yourself. So um, please don't ask me to rate the CEOs because I can't do that. <laughs> I have worked with three CEOs and each one has made a positive contribution in so many areas. So I think that each one has done a great job on really making staff feel as though they're part of the organization, that they're making contributions and empowerment at the same time. To me, I've always said, it doesn't matter how much you know, it's how much you are respected. And I think when you have those two, it helps you even when you make a mistake, you're easily forgiven. So that has been, I consider my trademark. None of this could have happened or could have been accomplished without the help and assistance from others. I could not have moved from admin to research without someone giving approval. I had a help along the way. I didn't do it alone. So I think that sh shows the support that you get within the organization. I mean, there isn't one thing that I don't know s a little something about. And I find that unique. It's a golden opportunity. How many people can say that you know about every division in your organization or had an opportunity to put your little hands here and there in little pieces and walk away and say, I made a contribution? That's how I feel. And people ask me, you know, why is it you stayed so long? <laughs> Well, I'm going to be selfish and say because I accomplished what I wanted to accomplish. That is why I stayed at AIR for so long. And was it Frank Sinatra who said it? I did it my way? <laughs> I did it my way. <laughs>